Ben, what an evening and what an occasion. 50,000 fans here to cheer on Wrexham. What was it like walking out into the stadium? Yeah, it was a bit surreal actually. You know, the noise is different to the noise in England. They're just so excited and um, yeah, it was, it was an amazing experience, yeah. And the second game really of pre-season after the behind closed doors yeah. friendly. How's it looking in the camp? What's the mood like at the moment? Yeah, I mean, the morale's good. It's great. It's, um, listen, the game was, it was tough. We feel like we held our own. We had, we had our fair share of chances. First half, they had two chances to score two goals. There's going to be, you know, certain bits that are a bit rusty and, and things like that. But yeah, I think the morale in general is very, very good. And like you say, despite the result, still lots of positives away to take away from tonight. Yeah. Any standouts for you at the moment? Uh, I mean, I think in general it was a great team performance. Moles was getting them down the side really well and, and, and causing the defence all sorts of problems. But, you know, I'm just happy that our keeper didn't really have much to do in both both halves. I know they scored five goals at sounds daft, but it wasn't like he was saving shots left, right and centre, so... So yeah, generally very happy. And three days into sort of the American tour, how's everyone acclimatising to the conditions, the environment? Yeah, good. Yeah, good. Personally, myself, last night was the first night I've had a good night's sleep, a proper full night's sleep. So uh, yeah, I'm glad that tonight's going to be broken up and we're going to have a three-hour time difference again. But yeah, no, listen, it's, it's just something that's a bit, a bit surreal and we're, we're all enjoying the experience. And you can see the hard work you've been putting in over the week now reflecting in tonight's performance. You know, double sessions, working up to it. Yeah. Real positive to take away. Yeah, and we, we played some good stuff as well in possession, so that's that's great. Um, against a team like this with the players they've got, they're so sharp and, and it's always going to be tough. So it was always going to be a, a workout. The majority of it was always going to be without the ball, but we've done some really nice stuff in possession as well. And obviously while you've been here as well, you haven't just obviously been training, you've been doing some community work as well. What was the visit like to the hospital earlier in the week and getting yeah. out to see the wider community? It was really touching actually to go to the hospital and to see the, the, the kids in such good spirits considering what they're, they're having to go through. And it was, it was really nice to kind of offer that, offer that support and uh, you know, give them a bit of positivity really. And the community have really come out tonight. You know, like we said it already, 50,000 fans yeah. coming and filling this stadium to watch Wrexham FC. You know, in America, how like does it blow your mind just what's going yeah, on? Yeah, it's 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 bonkers. It's it's absolutely bonkers for us. It's amazing, of course, but it's um, it was nice to we went to a shop earlier to buy some merchandise and, and things like that, and there were fans in there knocking around, and it was really nice to meet them and um, yeah, just to have this experience with them is is incredible and. You know, I'm sure there's, there's plenty more to come as well. And you mentioned it already, you know, starting to look forward to LA now and the next game, you know, uh, lots to, to take away from tonight. What do you think will be the focus of here over the next few days? Uh, definitely recovery. You know, with, with, with travelling, recovery is absolutely key. But, you know, uh, our morale and, and everything in the camp is, is positive. You know, with the result, it's about just dusting yourselves down and realising what the bigger picture is. It's about getting the fitness in and... We'd rather be playing against Chelsea in, in front of 50,000 than we would a normal pre-season game back at home. You know, no disrespect, but that's what everyone would rather be doing. So, yeah, let's just take the positives and, and look forward to the next one. And any final message? LA Galaxy 2 obviously up next. Anybody thinking about coming? What would you say to them? Just, just come and enjoy it. You know, we'll, we'll always appreciate your, your support and come and say hello. And, uh, yeah, just, just don't make yourself a stranger. Just come and say hello. Nice one.